An old photograph of a young Camille Vasquez standing alongside with Dr. Shannon Curry has resurfaced on Reddit, and the internet just can't stop gushing over it. However, Amber Heard might not be too happy seeing it. Both women were beloved on the internet for their actions and behavior during the Depp vs. Heard trial as they worked against Amber. The photo of them together has made everyone marvel at their sisterhood and bond with Johnny. So what is this photograph? What would Amber say about it? Keep watching to find out. A photograph was posted on the subreddit Justice for Johnny Depp. It had Camille Vasquez, Dr. Curry, and an unidentified woman posing together in a very wholesome picture. The internet cannot stop going aww at it, but Amber might not be impressed by the picture. The exact origins of it are unknown, and neither Camille nor Dr. Curry have commented on their friendship. However, the internet is flooding with comments praising the two women and speaking about how their sisterhood saved Johnny from Amber. While Amber has not spoken out against the two directly, sources reveal that she does not favor either of them. One person stated that Camille and Dr. Curry are everything Amber is not and will never be. Successful, intelligent, and articulate professionals. The fact that they are also attractive is unvaluable. All of the women on JD's team were fantastic, and I have no doubt AH would have despised them all. Elaine and Dr. Hughes were not even in the running, and Amber probably despises them as well. Another commented that, I can only imagine how annoyed Amber is by this photo. These women are far more beautiful than she is, both inside and out. They're completely out of her league. They, unlike Amber, have advanced degrees and are at the pinnacle of their professions, living their best lives and receiving recognition for it. That has to be tearing Amber up inside. One more comment reads that true social justice fighters. AH wished she could be like them. It must drive her insane that she has no actual talent and was snubbed by these professional role models. Another added that, I don't believe those smiles, not at all. Behind them are the most ruthless, I'll crush you because my intellect is superior people I've seen in a long, long time. Who is the middle lady? By association, I'm afraid of her. On that, a person replied that intelligent people are typically nice. Unless, of course, they are disordered, which they do not appear to be. Dumb does not imply innocent. Take a look at Amber Turd. And another person added a reply that, Oh no, you should not be afraid of such women if you are truthful. These women are more likely to be illogical and compassionate than Elaine, Amber, Whitney, Io, and Rocky. You're in unfamiliar territory with them. One fan commented that all women need role models, the polar opposite of pick me women. On that, a person replied saying, Yup, indeed. When they talk about this trial being a set back for women. This is one of the things that makes no sense, as in WTF. From the no-nonsense judge who only wants respect, to the sharp-as-a-whip all-business curry, to Camille rising from associate to partner in one case and becoming the world's most famous lawyer. If this is one takeaway from this case, it is that using sex appeal, emotion, and your status to get ahead, as demonstrated by Amber and Elaine, does not work nearly as well as getting yourself educated and commanding authority. They didn't have to pretend to be strong or anything because it didn't matter if they were men or women. They were correct, had the evidence to back it up, and didn't care about anything else. It didn't make them look like babes or unfeminine in any way. They simply appeared to be a jerk. But it's a setback for women because Barbie couldn't win a case by fluttering her eyelashes. And Elaine's strategy of winning on sexist women is always the victim's fault. So believe her. No, it does not. The trial was completely dominated by women. They dominated the situation. It has done more for women than any hashtag trending for a few weeks. How many little girls wish they could be Camille Vasquez or Dr. Curry right now? How many little girls are sitting there thinking that if I become experts like these women, I'll be untouchable as well? The whole thing is a success. Camille Vasquez, an attorney on Johnny Depp's legal team, is one of the trial's most well-known figures. The lawyer and associate in Brown Rudnick's litigation and arbitration practice group gained instant internet fame when she cross-examined Heard following her testimony at the trial. Vasquez's TikTok hashtag is over a billion views and has been dubbed the queen of the trial. Netizens couldn't get enough of her cross-examinations, her vehement defense of Depp, and her powerful closing argument at the trial. She is regarded as a female role model for the eloquent and powerful manner in which she handled the trial while exposing Heard's alleged lies. Since the cross-examination, she has trended almost every day on Twitter, and people clearly adore her friendship with Depp and fellow lawyer Benjamin Chu. The attorney now has fan art, edits, messages of admiration, and a dedicated fan base. Dr. Shannon Curry, a clinical and forensic psychologist who testified for Depp at the trial, is another widely admired figure involved in the defamation trial. 
Curry was praised for her astute observations and persuasive testimony. She has over 15 years of experience in therapy and assessment in military, forensic, and community settings. Curry, the director of the Curry Psychology Group, has become a popular crush as people admire her confident and calm demeanor, as well as her accomplished personality. According to one user, I just want to say that as a victim of abuse, Dr. Shannon Curry has been the most validating expert to listen to. She makes me feel heard and comprehended. Another person stated, Also, many thanks to Johnny Depp's legal team for introducing the world to Dr. Shannon Curry. She's a wonderful woman and a skilled psychologist. Definitely someone to look up to. What do you think of Camille and Dr. Curry's friendship? Let us know in the comments down below. Make sure to like and subscribe for more.